Hi and welcome Leo Rose Burnett here Mind Body Soul Balance this is your singles and you love reading for August 2021 it is a general reading so it's trust yourself what resonates leave what does not big welcome to those that are new to my channel and those that follow me regularly awesome to have you here before we get started there is a competition giveaway so if you want to enter it there's a couple of oracle decks up for grabs just need to be a new subscriber to my channel or opt into the extended versions of my readings this month. You'll go into the draw to win the beautiful, precious gems oracle, gorgeous deck. Mm -hmm. And those that follow me regularly, you'll go into the draw to win the beautiful Nature's Whispers oracle. I'll be looking for a very positive community member. Winners will be announced at the end of the month on my channel. Now, July winners have been announced, so listen up and to see if it's you. Matt Levi won for new subscribers, he won the uh, Kunyan Oracle and Karen Edwards won for existing members and won the beautiful Messenger Oracle. So if that is you, get in touch. My email is down below to claim your prize. And to get hold of the extended versions, very simple. Hit the join button on my channel, very first link below. They're only $5.99 a month. You get the extended version of the monthly, mid-monthly bonus love reading every month for VIP members. So three videos extra every month just for $5.99. If you want to invest in yourself, go and check those out. My personal readings are open if you need extra guidance and support, reach out. Link will pop up here, booking info down below. Follow me on Instagram. I do a lot of daily motivation, inspiration over there, stuff you won't see on YouTube. So come say hi. All right, let's get started, Leo. So how this works, we've got singles on this side. We've got new love over here. We're going to pull the energies to both, yeah? So first up, let's pull you some guidance from the uh, Lovers Oracle. And happy birthday to those of you having a birthday. My number of brothers having his 50th, yeah. I think it's uh, not this weekend, next weekend. Mm -hmm. I have to be honest, I've got a lot of Leos in my world. Mm -hmm. Oh, this is kind of beautiful. There's an angel here doing some energy healing. It's all about healing. It says, imagine yourself and your beloved surrounded by light. Feel your relationship being healed this very moment. So if there's anything going on in terms of issues, certainly the ability to heal them at this time. All right, let's please some guidance with the Romance Angel Oracle. First up, singles. You got two here. Okay, wow. Oh, oh, darlings. Oh, you got unrequited love, not enough chemistry attraction to keep this connection going and there was deception someone's wearing a false mask in this connection so you may have just gone through that kind of situation um if it happens to you in august you know it's something just to be mindful of we'll see what else comes out all right let's have a look at new love here oh you got a lot of passion and chemistry going on so it's a strong attraction here Oh, and you got the message to release your ex. Yeah, open up to this new love. Let go of the past. All right, singles. Oh, you got the message it's safe you love to open your heart up to love. So if you've gone through situations where it was unrequited in the past, there was deception going on, Spirit's saying don't let that stop you, yeah? Not everyone's going to be like that. And you've got a past life relationship. Yeah, you've known each other before. So it could have even been a soulmate you were with. It could also mean you've got a soulmate coming in. All right, let's have a look at new love. Oh, hello. you got wedding on the cards here, yeah? Mm -hmm. So you can certainly be a keeper. Connection that may lead to marriage. And you got the message to pay attention to the red flags, the signs are cautioning you. Uh, directly related to release your ex. So what does that mean? It means don't ignore red flags in connections because it will derail it later on. You know, if you've gone through a challenging time in love, learn from it um, so that you know that you're not going to choose someone the same. Yeah. Avoid recycling through the same relationship patterns all right let's put some guidance from the angel answers oracle first with singles yeah spirit's saying to wait okay we'll find out why they're saying there's no need to worry so particularly about things that haven't worked out spirit's just saying not that way my darling something better for you you've got some perfect timing going on in your love life right now all right let's have a look at new love over here Okay, you've got recovery here. So one of you is in health recovery. 
And Spirit's saying to very much listen to your intuition, what feels right for you. And second guess yourself. And absolutely up to you if you want to be in this connection, how you feel about it. Let's dive deeper, darlings. Let's have a look at singles over here. Dare I say, I've been through a bit of a rough time. Oh, some of you single and ready to mingle. Putting yourself out there for love. And you're going through a massive transformation right now. Yeah, it's leading to beautiful personal growth. So some of you have certainly overcome these challenges. Yeah, healing every day, my light gets brighter and brighter. So some of you have done a lot of work on yourself. You've not let the past, you know, dent you too much. Let's have a look at this new love connection. Oh, soulmates, we may crash and burn, but the memory will last forever. So you may be there to teach each other a lesson. And I feel so good when I'm with you. Oh, that's kind of beautiful. Oh, watch this, yeah. So you got juggler, charming, funny, here, gone, back again. So Spirit's saying just to be mindful in new connections as to who's real and authentic and who's not, yeah. Just be mindful of that, that's all. All right, let's have a look at the heart of the matter. Firstly, singles. Is there any guidance here for singles? Oh, you got two. Oh, yeah. Oh, grab hold of it. Uh, you've got the healing work that you've been doing is working. Um, just keep going. Two messages about that. And you just need to trust yourself more, particularly your intuition uh, when it comes to people, new connections. All right, let's have a look at new love over here. Oh, my ex is still in my heart and I've been unable to let it go. Well, that's come out twice on that side. The spirit's saying you need to release that energy. If that doesn't resonate with you, it could be the person you're dealing with. Yeah, think about that. Yeah, there's an unresolved issues or a balance of power creating resentment here. So um, what does that mean? It means that somebody may, one person in this connection is controlling things in terms of how fast it goes, the dates, all that kind of stuff, perhaps pull, holding back a bit, which can create resentment because it may not, it may stifle their natural flow of a connection. All right, let's put you some relationship influences. First up, singles have been doing a lot of healing. Yeah, some of you are in recovery right now. It's come out on both sides. So it's emotional health recovery. Oh, Spirit's saying there's something better than what you went through in the past or any unrequited love situations that happened this month. And to make an effort in love if you want love. All right, let's have a look at this new love situation over here. Uh, you've got new adventures, so you might be exploring, doing new things together. And Spirit's saying to join a group, so maybe by yourself, maybe together. Mm-hmm. And you've got distance here. So this person, you might need to travel towards each other. Might be a bit of location differences between you. Let's have a look at love attributes, which can be your love language, the things that are important in a connection to you or the person you're connecting with. First up, singles. Oh, so money is a bit of a focus or an issue right now for you. Uh, you're a bit of a loner. So how do you get out of that space to connect with someone? And you like to receive things as your love language. So your partner giving you gifts. All right, let's have a look at new love over here. Oh, there's some codependent behaviors going on here. Could be you, could be them. Uh, financial stability is really important. Isn't it interesting? Money's come out on both sides. And they're very ambitious, dare I say. All right, let's put you some soulmate messages. Firstly, singles. Oh, it says a profound transformation is taking place in your life. Be yourself. You have much to offer the world by just being you. Your love has the power to transform all things, including your relationship and your love life. So definitely going through massive personal growth. All right, let's have a look at new love over here. It says life is constantly changing, yet at its core it remains the same. Love does not change. It only grows stronger. 
Change is simply love unfolding in a never-ending story. So what does that mean? Well, we're always learning here. Yeah? We're always growing through love relationships. Mm -hmm. All right, let's put some guidance from the Whispers of Love Oracle. Wow. It's kind of almost exactly what I said. Number 33, message directly from an ascended master or one trying to connect with you or you are an ascended master. It says to appreciate this moment. It says every situation is an opportunity to grow and find love. Pretty much exactly what I said. Yep. <laughs> All right, my loves, those are your messages. Love to your feedback, your comments down below on how it resonated with you. Hit the like button, hit the subscribe button, absolutely helps my channel. And you'll notice there's also a thanks button. So if you really enjoyed it, would like to contribute back to my channel, more than welcome, most appreciative. You don't have to, but if you want to, you can. Reach out if you need extra guidance with the personal reading info on here and down below. Take it easy, my loves, for now. Much love, much light. Namaste.